So welcome back to some more Game Dev Tycoon, where last time, we made so much money off of this, holy crap. I mean, like, Jesus, we're doing good. We are doing really, really good. And this time, we're going to be making even more money, and now that we have a new team member, we can actually start doing stuff. And we're going to make a new game, because why not? Um, I do want to make like a game or two before we start making a new engine, because again, I do need more stuff to unlock for that. So, we have not done a simulator in a bit. Uh, we also don't have many topics left, but I'm not going to be worrying about topics that much because we have so many other topics we haven't even tried yet, so. We can do... what can we do? Um, hmm. What's a sim I could do? The only bad thing with Sim is that I could I can't really put it on multi platforms. That's the only bad thing with that. We could do a horror sim. Or a horror adventure. Eh, no, horror horror simulation. And then see, I don't know. Cause I'm thinking like I don't know. I'm thinking more like Silent Hill and stuff like that. Definitely gonna be mature. We'll put it on the PS3. PC, and I guess the Xbox, because we're now topical with that. Medium on the Disturb Knot. See, now it makes sense for this to be called Disturb Knot. So, and we'll do, um, I d okay, I actually want to make my own title and not just a spoof. So, um, God, now I'm only thinking of spoofs, and that's not exactly great. Um, we'll call, you know what? We'll call it Abyss. I think Abyss is a cool name. Yeah. Abyss. There we go. So let us start making stuff. I think I'm gonna make this game and then we'll. Uh, oh, hello. Wamo Wamoba Oil Limited. High repute. Invest 2.5 buttless. Uh, we have deposited the amount in the safe bank. Transfer this money, but. Uh, I'm good. Thanks. I'd, I'd rather not be scammed. <laughs> Just saying. Alright. So, story and quest. No. Engine sip and gameplay. Yeah. Um, we'll have a linear story, because you have to at least understand what's going on. Um, online, save to cloud, I guess. Well, okay, maybe not save to cloud. And then gameplay, that's fine. Okay. Good thing is that... Oh, yeah, and we have another design guy, too. Because we don't really need that much tech people. I mean, I'm going to get one more tech guy in case we need him, but otherwise, we're pretty good. So, gameplay, that can stay to me... Or, that could actually go to Joe if I really wanted to, but... Actually, I am going to give that to Joe. Joe might be just our other balanced guy, because the only other balanced person is me. And I'm focusing myself to be a design person, so... Maybe we'll work on Joe being a... Just... Generic... Take care of stuff guy. Engines, that that's definitely a tech thing, so we will go... Yeah, Lane's good for that. Actually, Aiden's better for that now. I think it's a fight between Aiden and <laughs> Lane for the spot of engine. And then, story and quests, that's a design thing, so we'll... Actually, we'll put John on that since he's new. Yeah, that's fine. He's a brand new guy. He'll be solely responsible for that. Oh, and this is perfect. Perfect, E3 time. We just <laughs> started the game. Uh, and yeah, there's our old game. 10th Fantasy. Wait, why is it showing the Wii and the PS3? I guess for older games. Okay. 300,000. Man, we jumped up 100,000 from that time. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. So, let's keep on uh, going with our stuff. Man, this is going slow. Why? Uh, where's Newt? Uh, yes. Uh, curious about what decisions. Horror simulation. More on gameplay. Because I'd rather scare the shit out of you than be interested in the story, apparently. <laughs> We're gonna use cheapo jump scares and crap. Um, yeah, they agree with it. That's good. I mean, that just generates a little bit more hype. A few companies have fallen victim to Nigerian scammers. <laughs> yeah. I, I mean, there's a reason why I don't even pick up calls that say scam likely. I don't care if you're a doctor, if it's important. Okay, well, first of all, doctors should not be using their own damn personal number to tell patients that they need medication or whatever. Because that is stupid, and I hate it. Um, like You just complicate issues. Because every time a doctor calls you, it comes up as scam likely, and it's bullshit. I just don't pick up the number, because if it's important, then you'll voicemail me about it. 
and I don't trust you if it comes up as scam likely. Like, I know that's not the doctor's fault, but just stop using your personal number for business stuff. That's stupid. Unless if you're, like, running your own personal business. Like, no wonder people's not picking up. Anyway, I'm sorry. I, <laughs> I had to go on that rant. All right, so Aiden's definitely staying on there. Level design. Barbara can stay on. Although, I may want to put John on that. Actually, John would... John could be better for something later. Yeah, we don't have to rely upon Barbara for that. Then Dialogues will put myself on that. That's fine. Because even if we're not doing anything with a certain slider, it's still good to have somebody with high stats on... Oh, God. Did not mean to do that. Yeah, we're going to move around the screen now, which is weird. But <laughs> that'll be for something later. Anyway. Come on. Also, this would be fun to chill out, man. That, that would be fun. Because this... I don't know why. This reminds me of college for some reason. <laughs> then again, it was only me and my roommate that ever played anything. So, world design go to ass. And then... I would think sound is pretty important. All things considering. Considering, like, it's a horror game. So, I'm going to say that. Graphics can go to John. World design... Um, okay, well, first of all... I'm going to put myself on sound. And then... We'll give Elaine something to do, <laughs> I guess. Uh, all right, and then we'll put stereo sounds. We do not need rich backstory or an open... Actually, yeah, we don't need a cycle. We just have open world. Actually, we don't even need an open world. Yeah, no, world design can go to hell. Let's do it. We're doing pretty good. I mean, we dipped below 10 mil, but I mean, that's a whole lot better than being bankrupt. Normalize again with no particular trends. Cool. So... Uh, oh, now there's a tablet. Just, they're really going forward with these mobile games. I am not making mobile games. I'm sorry. That seems stupid. Man, we're not getting a lot of points here. Seriously. I guess it doesn't need that many points. I don't know. Got a lot of hype behind it, though. People really want the competitor to <laughs> Silent Hill. All right, get rid of those bugs, boys. And girls. Two girls and four guys in here. All right, come on. Are we good? Uh, somebody found a bug. Okay, that's good. Hammer out that bug. And there's another bug. C man, come on, guys. There we go. We were starting to lose hype. Now it's not good. New topic, good management, new combo. Ooh, graphics leveled up as well. Increase in salaries. And the Wii U. Oh, no, the Wii U. <laughs> I actually like the Wii U. I, I actually really like that a lot, but... Yeah, it did not do good. I don't know why I did that. That was stupid. Okay, whatever. Elaine, you're going to be training. We'll do some more tech for you. Actually, I think these give more now. Game design, crash course, programming course. Here we go. We'll do that. Reviews. Uh-oh. Okay, well, that didn't... That didn't do too hot. We're still going to make money off of it, but that did not do that great. I don't know what I really did wrong. I, okay, it was mostly Star Games that didn't like it. All right, Barbara... Let's get you some design. You'll actually be applicable for the boost now, I think. Uh, you... Yeah, you're tech, so... I guess... Yeah, we'll just do the programming course for you again. John, you are going to be design, so we'll do a game design course. And then me, I'm going to research some new stuff. I don't have 100 research points. Okay. Uh, da 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 We'll do skill... I, well, hmm. Yeah, we'll do skill trees. Screw it. Because I'm, I'm wanting to make our next major game engine now. Especially since we got this money in the back burner. So, great. Great. People are wanting to go off on vacation. Crap. Okay. You go to vacation. And then what went wrong? Horror... Oh, it's... it's really? Okay, so it's a wonder I actually did... So I did all the right stuff. It was just a bad combination. I might be thinking of Horror Adventure. Okay, I mean, that's fine. We still made money off of it. Maybe I'll make one more game before we make the new engine. Especially since it's kind of an awkward time. Plus, we need some contra... Oh my god, that gives you so much. But yeah, uh, we'll just do that one. We'll probably be able to get through that one. Alright, so everybody work on the contract stuff. Because we need to make some money. <laughs> At least with this, I can uh, make a sequel and make back some more money. So, I mean, again, I want to... I really want to make a new engine, but, I, again, I have to make a new game if I want to make a new engine, because then I'm going to kind of screw myself if I don't do that, so... 
get some more contract work, make back some more money. Man, you guys are going haywire. Mixed reviews, yeah. Huh, I wonder what the next major console from uh, Nintendo is going to do. The Wii U is going to be the, the best console in the world, considering the Wii did so good during its time. Uh, I, I Again, am I one of the few people that actually likes the Wii U? It was kind of like the GameCube of the Wii era. <laughs> like, I kind of felt bad about it, because, like, I actually like the Wii U, uh, the Wii U a lot. The game, like, games for it looked beautiful. Like, you look at, um, what's it? Nintendo Land and, um, New Super Mario Bros. U. Like, they're very pretty games for the time. Uh, these are just kind of... Okay, I can do this one. I don't think the three weeks are a problem, especially with our tech skills. Um, I did not see that you need to be on vacation. Okay, what about some publishing deals, actually? Post-apocalyptic... No. Any topic, any genre for the GERPAD. Uh, I could make a casual game. Could try to do a rhythm game on that. That would be perfect for an iPad. Disastrous action. Why is it only Apple? Any topic, any genre for the Xbox. Ooh. Ooh, you know what I could do? I could try to make Halo. Hmm. Just in case it fails, I'm going to save, but minimum score of five mature. Yeah. Yeah, screw it. Okay, yeah, because we are going to... Okay, yeah, action... Uh, okay, yeah. What topic? Jesus, that's what I was trying to find. Sci-fi, sci-fi action, mature game. Uh, and we could actually add it to more stuff if I want to. Uh, do I want it on the PS3? Do I want it on the PS3? It's already costing some money. We'll keep it on the Xbox. We'll have an exclusive for the Xbox. We'll, we'll, I mean, we are partly Bungie, so it's actually kind of applicable that we're making <laughs> a Halo game. Um, in which case we will call it Balo. So, yeah. Um, ba Balo, um, Combat Devolved. There we go. <laughs> Just, there's our spoof for today. Alright, 3D Graphics V2. And the nice thing is, yeah, we'll have a bunch of, um, what's it? We'll probably have some hype behind it, because who are we making this for, by the way? I don't even, <laughs> I didn't even see who we were making it for. All right, so engine all the way up, gameplay lowered. We do not need story and quests, so that can go to hell. Um, we'll just have a linear story. And then definitely multi, or actually online play, save to cloud, absolutely. Like, are you kidding me? All right, engine, uh, who is our biggest tech person now? Elaine, okay. Again, <laughs> Aiden and Elaine are just fighting for rights for the engine. <laughs> and then Barbara should actually, I need to save her for level design, so second highest person is me, right? Yeah, second highest person is me, so we'll put myself on there. And then I guess Joe could take care of story and quests. That's fine. At least he's doing something. Because it may look like that Joe's just completely useless, but he's filtering out a lot of the workload for a lot of people, so that's why I'm keeping him around. Okay, really? Why do you guys stop randomly? Oh my god, lots of points are going everywhere. Holy Jesus. <laughs> I do want to work towards getting the boosts as well. That's why we, we need more research points. I've been spamming a bunch of it. Okay. So, we're good on that. So, AI. Who is our biggest tech person? That would be Aiden. I think Aiden's fine. For, or actually, no. Elaine is more. We're definitely going to need level design. So, I could put... Well, I can keep Barbara on that. Yeah, these look fine. I don't really... Yeah, I think I'm just going to swap this out for Elaine. And then if we need more tech stuff, we'll leave it to uh, Aiden. Yeah. Only bad thing is that these two are kind of doing nothing, but Aiden will probably have something to do, and then John can do more uh, design stuff. So that's good. That's good. We're doing good. Ah, yes. We announced Balo Combat Evolved. I don't, again, I don't know who the publisher was for this. I, I didn't even look. Because if it was Activision, that would have been hilarious. Uh, screw you, Activision. Uh, around the same amount of people. One day we'll hit top 100. One day. And the weird thing is, too, we almost got 10 years left of this main game. Now, it does go infinitely, if you so wish. You just won't have new consoles come out. That's the only bad thing. So we'll have open world, because Halo was an open world. I don't think I had day and night cycle. So we'll have stereo sound. Okay, and then for graphics, we will have Barbara. Perfect. World design, Um, I guess 
you'll be good on that. And then Aiden can take care of sound, I think. Actually, I could put... See, uh, sound a technical thing. I don't think it... All these sound like design choices. I'll, I'll screw it. Put Aiden on that. We'll at least have something. It's not... I mean... I mean, Halo did have an orchestral soundtrack, but damn it, it's not that important. <laughs> Along with that, Halo came out in the Xbox, like, original Xbox, and not the Xbox 360, but it's fine. This is the, uh, the great value Halo, <laughs> so... Considering we can't even make large games yet. Which, large games, as it sounds, are just larger versions of medium games. So, alright. Let's filter out all that stuff. I think one interesting thing they could have added was, uh... If you were doing a publishing deal, you would have to do, uh, like, game deadlines. Alright, we are good. I think that would have been an interesting mechanic if you had to, like, work around the deadline. That would have been annoying as hell, though. Alright. Uh, 41k. Alright. So you... Actually, I don't... Hmm. Yeah, I think we just need more research points. So let's do some contract work. Now that there's more of it. Uh, we could probably do this. We have enough money for it. Or enough people. See, uh, oh, it's, it's Cave Johnson. Product placement. Marketing boys tell me making you this offer is a bad idea, but that's exactly why I want it. I'll pay you 200000 to place some of our fine red painted exploding barrels in one of your games. Sure. Spirit in you. Yeah, it's literally Cave Johnson. <laughs> Great reference, by the way. Love it. And the Wii's gonna be taken off the market. Sad. Uh, as long as we make above a five, we're good. Which I think we will. Unless if one of these gives us a four. Okay, yeah, these are higher expectations. Cool. That's gonna make us a lot of money. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, a million units in the first, uh, more than a million units, holy crap. All right, more contract work. Let us do this one. More than 100,000 fans. We can self-publish medium games. Cool. All right, Micronoft. Oh my God. <laughs> it was Microsoft, yes. Oh my god, yeah, we straight up just made Halo. Oh, alright, cool. Thanks, Microsoft. Surely we won't break away from you and make our own game that is arbitrarily better nowadays. Eh, we love Destiny. Anyway. Uh, we could do this one, I think. Man, look how much. I mean, we're not making a ton of money from it, but the units are skyrocketing. Holy crap. Large games. There we go. So... I think what we're gonna do is, um, we're gonna, I, okay, I can't see what the hell I'm doing. Uh, I, really? Can I, hmm, there we go. Got rid of that. That, that is an annoyance. I wish they would fix that. Let's push 150k. We need, do we want more design people? Because our tech people are kind of just doing nothing. And we'll get another tech person. We have a bunch of design people as it is. All right, let's do some more contract work. Uh, still can't really do that. We'll do this one, and then we'll start researching some stuff, because I want to make our new engine. Actually, we might just make our new engine now that now I'm thinking about it. Screw it. So, 3D Graphics V3. We don't need that anymore. Uh, basic Physics. Multi-platform opt- Oh, that's why. Okay. Also, that costs two million. Why? Skill trees, achievements. Pretty much just get everything we can. 3.4 mil, that's fine. And what spoof am I going to create now? We had Disturbed and Slipknot. So we'll do, um, uh, oh god. Where, okay, where are two songs I've been listening to a bunch? Now I'm thinking about it. Um, ooh. Red Omens. Uh, Bad Omens and Red. If you've never listened to Red, highly recommended. Really, really good band. Anyway, create the engine. Or most expensive engine we've ever had. Oh my god, why do you have so much tech? Jesus! Also, I'm gonna have to censor that at the bottom right. Oops. Uh, wow. Jesus. These are very heavy tech people. God. Level 4, level 3. I could probably make you into this if I just work. Yeah, Anthony, get in here. <laughs> Hello. Welcome. Uh, don't worry about the engine that we're creating. It's fine. Ugh. Yeah, the Wii's no longer report, uh, supported. You made 2.7 million off of it. Awesome. Yeah, so we'll uh, get this engine done. Red Omens is a really cool name, actually. Yeah, if you've never listened to Red or Bad Omens, definitely take a listen. Uh, the, all of these bands I'm listing off are rock bands because that's all I listen to, so I apologize. 
but I also wanted to do this engine so that we can get a bunch of research points, so that's part of the reason. Right, come on. Give us more points. Please. Man, this is taking forever, huh? I mean, we do have a lot of stuff loaded into this. I mean, eventually you'll just get to the point where you'll have a bunch of stuff to put into an engine and you'll just have everything. All right, cool. Red Omens is completed. And with that said, we are going to end things off for this one. So, next time on Game Dev Tycoon, we'll be making even more games now that we have a fully loaded up staff. So, I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.